Let's go and take a look at Old Beaupre Castle near Cowbridge, South Wales. Welcome to our journey through time as we explore the historic Beaupre Castle. Today we'll uncover the secrets of this medieval site, its architecture and the stories it holds. Despite the name and its medieval origins, Old Beaupre is really more manor house than castle. Built in two stages, the older part was constructed around 1300, while a major renovation in the 16th century by the Bassett family produced some of its most impressive remaining features. These include the well-preserved three-storied gatehouse and striking porch. Decorated with columns inspired by architecture of ancient Greece and bearing the family's crest carved in stone. Designed to demonstrate Bassett's wealth and importance, these Tudor symbols of status give a revealing glimpse into how this grand property would have looked in its heyday. The castle's layout reflects its dual purpose as a defensive stronghold and a comfortable residence. The courtyard we overlook now would have been a hub of activity, bustling with the daily life of the Bassett family and their servants. After the 16th century alterations, little work was carried out on Beaupre, and after the English Civil War, the Bassett family fortunes went into decline. At the beginning of the 18th century, the Bassett inheritance eventually passed to the Jones family. The Jones family decided not to settle in Beaupre Castle and chose to use the smaller and more convenient mansion of New Beaupre. The castle was sold in 1709 
and by that time it was in a state of disrepair. The only part of it is still habitable. Nevertheless, there is some evidence that it continued to be at least partly occupied as various fireplaces and windows were blocked up, presumably to reduce the taxes payable.
Here we are in the gatehouse, one of the oldest parts of the castle. This structure was designed to defend against potential invaders with its thick stone walls. The detailed stonework and carvings you see here are testament to the craftsmanship of medieval builders. Each piece has a story to tell about the people who lived and worked in this castle. The Barsets were a powerful and influential family in medieval Wales. They were known for their loyalty to the English crown and their role in local governance and politics. This great hall, with its impressive fireplace, was the heart of the castle. It was here that the Bassett family would host feasts and gatherings, showcasing their wealth and hospitality. Each room in the castle serves as a window into the past. This chamber, for example, was likely used as a private living space, offering a glimpse into the daily life of the castle's inhabitants. Beaupre Castle is a remarkable example of a medieval fortified manor house that evolved over the centuries. Its architectural features and historical records provide valuable insights into the lives of the Welsh gentry.
The castle's location was not only strategic for defence, but also ideal for overseeing the vast lands managed by the Bassets. The surrounding landscape, once filled with farmland and forests, played a crucial role in the castle's self-sufficiency. The chapel was an essential part of the castle, reflecting the religious devotion of the Bassett family. It's fascinating to see how faith and daily life were intertwined in medieval times. Our exploration of Beaupre Castle reveals a rich tapestry of history, architecture and daily life, spanning several centuries from its origins as a fortified manor to its transformation into a Renaissance residence. Beaupre Castle stands as a testament to the enduring legacy of the Bassett family. And there it is, Old Beaupre Castle. If you've enjoyed this video, don't forget, like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you all on the next one.